Welcome to ShopRite of Mullica Hill, where quality and customer service is always in season. Discover our vibrant produce department, where we prioritize freshness, sourcing locally whenever possible. Head to our deli for premium meats and cheeses. No time to cook? Try our selection of store-made meals. And don't forget the sushi. From the bakery to the butcher. Seafood to shop from home. ShopRite of Mullica Hill is your ultimate one-stop grocery destination. Come visit us today. Temperatures top down a couple of degrees above average for this time of the year. We hit 75, normal is 72, and this morning we were a few degrees below average. We hit 48, average is around 50 to 51 degrees. But at this point, temperatures are starting to cool back down to those low and mid-60s. We're at 62 in Vineland, also Mays Landing, 63, Glassboro, 64 in Hamilton. Holding on to the low and mid-60s closer to the shore in our warm spots are Marlton and Trenton, where we are still holding on to those lower 70s. But over the next couple of hours, clouds will gradually start to build back in as a cold front starts to work in, and we will see a couple of showers, maybe a rumble of thunder between about 4 and 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. Morning, but after that, we're right back to seeing a lot of sunshine for tomorrow afternoon. So at this point, most of us are mostly clear. We should stay that way until about 10 o'clock. After that, clouds gradually start to work back in as that cold front inches closer. Then it starts to sweep through by about 3 o'clock, leading to a couple of showers, maybe a rumble of thunder between 4 and 6 o'clock. And it's not going to be a lot of rain, maybe up to a tenth of an inch of rain at best. But other than that, our drought not really being helped by this rain, actually not being helped at all by this rain. And we're going to see a lot of dry weather in the next seven to 10 days. So, I mean, that drought is gradually going to get worse due to the lack of rainfall. So be sure that you keep a close eye on that drought monitor. But once again, by tomorrow afternoon, a lot of sunshine, no problems for tomorrow afternoon. So if you have any outdoor plans tomorrow or for the rest of the week, you're all in the clear. A lot of sunshine temperatures holding on to the low and mid 70s for tomorrow afternoon, but we gradually get cooler from there. We're down into the upper 60s by Tuesday and maybe down into the mid 60s as we head towards Wednesday and Thursday and take a look at our overnight lows. We're back down into the low to mid 40s, so be sure that you have your jacket heading off to work and school throughout the work week.